All right, so this is going to be a really short video explaining the uh, Sir Grackle fight. A bug was found in the fight where uh, Sir Grackle doesn't seem to be taking damage, and so we figured it out. So during the fight, Sir Grackle's got a couple different moves. Um, of particular interest to us is his little melee axe swing, and he's also got a melee sword swing. For whatever reason, if he does those melee attacks, if he does two of them in a row, without walking or moving at all, then he'll have some invincibility frames or the game won't take damage properly. So I've got a little movie of it here. I'm gonna be invincible for this just for demonstration purposes, but yeah, just focus on the uh, health value in the top right there. So every time you hit with a leather whip, it does 32 damage. So I'm hitting him, he's taking damage. This is his first swing, so I've got his health down to 832. And then in this case, he's going to be going into a second swing. So watch what happens when I do this second, uh, when I whip him again here. So I whip him again. Health is at 800 because I hit him again. And then, oh wait, it's at 832. Sorry, you thought it was supposed to go down. You can tell that he's doing that. You can tell he's doing two swings in a row because he has kind of a recoil animation like that that lasts a bit longer. That's how you know um, he's doing two in a That's how you know he's got the uh, invulnerability frames. And then once, you can see he's still flashing, it's not taking damage. Once he goes into um, the big wind up for his next swing, then he can take damage again, which is here. <clears throat> Uh, the most extreme example I've seen of this is in uh, Joe D'Amelio's highlight video, which I've got here. So as you watch, um, of course Joe places his cross as well, and so uh, Grackle's going to take a lot of damage down, but he's got his first swing coming up here. So that's his first swing. And then Joe immediately knocks the armor off. Um, but notice here, he's going into a second swing, and he's got that kind of recoil animation going, and then Joe manages to actually stunlock him in that recoil animation. And so it's not until he finishes the windup that Joe can actually hit him again and finish him off. So that's the most extreme case of it. Um, so for any percent, of course, you know, just pray it doesn't happen. And for low percent, um, if he pounds twice in a row, you just kind of may want to uh, watch out for that because uh, that is a thing. Uh, yeah, that's it.